Hi everybody, this is Mohamed Hamid, and in our session I will explain um, how we can use the sewer jams uh, to design uh, domestic networks in camps. I will open new one, new file, I will take my background, okay, so extend, now this is my background. Now I will import my network, which I make it in the uh, AutoCAD, to the sewer jams. Now we add our pipe. I will open my background and using model builder, I will import it from CAD file. Browse line, open next meter and here establish. Now next, next, next. I will say uh, select uh, for the key fields level. And next, next, and the model is, and now finish, and I will select yes, and now we draft a 320 70 conduits and 328 manhole. Okay, I will close. He will ask me to add it to the drawing. Yes, we have our network. We have to examine it first before we start design from the view from the navigator we can now check our networks if there are some mistake for example within close this for the tolerance okay nothing again for the manhole if there are two manhole or three manhole duplication in manhole I will take for the tolerance one meters. No, okay. I now to say the duplicate links, which is very important. No duplicate links, and for link missing node. No. Now for this related. Nothing for dead end. Uh, okay, no problem. This is uh, the the beginning manhole for uh, our line. No problem. I think this is also no no problem. In this uh, message. Okay, for network everything is good. We didn't have manhole. We should now uh, change it to alpha. So from layout. We take out that and we just press on the manhole. He will ask us if, he, if we want to morph or change the manhole to out value. We said yes, and now press right click done. Before I continue, I will arrange my symbology, which means the names. You see, this is long name. From the analysis, we have something which is. Flex table. So now we will go to conduit. We'll open this is table and this is uh, include a lot of properties about my conduit. Now we will go to the label, the right click, and we will uh, sort upstream to downstream. And now right click, we, we select relabel. From here we will take the number. He will ask an increment uh, one, and for the next is one. Uh, for the prefix, we will uh, use the default uh, from several gems. Co dash okay, and you say now we renumber this conduit in the same way. We will go to the manhole and right click sort upstream to downstream. And right click again and re, re label. We will select re number and we will use for the symbol MH. Okay, now he re number them all. And 
now we see the new number but uh, there are uh, problem in the symbology so here we have element symbology we will go to conduite and from the label we can on the right click or uh, two click on it so we'll see edit and now we will take the high multiplier we will choose for example 0 0.5 and press apply okay and for manual two click and we will use 0 0.5 and make apply but as you see it is long distance between the symbol and the, the manhole so we can adjust this so right click or two click and we can for the x we can make it for example uh, zero apply okay now it's close for it okay we'll stay here 